Hello everyone, it's currently 11.15 in the morning here in London. Just finished eating breakfast. I had a scone, which I have not had in so long. And I'm currently walking to go see an exhibition at one of my favorite galleries that I used to come to all the time when I lived here. And also, if you're wondering what this is on my face, um, I got a cold sore. So the first thing I did when I got to London was buy cold sore cream. And now I'm walking around looking like I forgot to wipe toothpaste off my face. The weather's not that great. It's not raining. It is not London without the rain. I didn't mention before at the beginning of this vlog, but I decided to do this trip because I was looking at pictures the other day of London, not even ones that I had taken. I think I was watching a film or it was on the news or the TV or something. I just saw photos of London and I got like really emotional out of nowhere. I was not expecting that. And I think it was just because I missed it. Like it was time for me to come back. I think the last time I was here was maybe a little over a year ago. So, I guess I'm just gonna have to keep coming back here every year. You know, London definitely holds a special place in my heart and it will for as long as I live. I truly do believe that. walking to my favorite bookstore in London. I would go here all the time when I was living here just to study or look at the books because they have about six floors of just different kinds of books, different genres, and I could honestly stay there for hours. So I'm gonna go check it out, see if it's still the same as before. It's really cool because I'm walking through London and since I lived here for two years, I keep having like flashbacks of like I'll see a specific area or like a specific restaurant that I went to with like a friend or with like my family and I'll just get all these memories coming back into my head which is really cool I think visiting somewhere that you already know can kind of bring you back in time like a time machine I walked past a restaurant that I used to go to all the time with my family and it just brought me back it brought me back like three years and it's a pretty cool experience this Asian grocery store that I really like because they have products that you wouldn't usually find in a typical grocery store and I got a hot bun I'm really hungry and I haven't eaten lunch yet and it's already almost 3 o'clock 
I'm on my way to the market not to go eat lunch, but I just got this as a little snack. I'm about to take the metro because I'm going to go to the other side of London to go to the food market. It's called Borough Market. And yeah, bring you guys along with me. chicken pie with mashed potatoes and gravy. Pretty tasty. I'm laying down in a park and it just started to rain. And I'm so comfortable and I don't want to get up. I was on my way walking to Covent Garden but I got distracted by a cat and then I decided it would be a good idea to lay down and then it started raining. So I'm gonna keep walking to Covent Garden. Just gonna get my ice cream. Walking to the bus station after a long, long day of walking around London. I'm going to the south of England now to go stay with a friend. I, and then I'm gonna come back to London and then I go to Ireland, well, Northern Ireland. I'm pretty sure the people at the ice cream place kept thinking that I had like ice cream all over my face, but it was only my cold sore cream. Also, I really want to wash my face. I feel so sticky.